Hi everyone, it's Tish with Naptime Creations. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. And if you're new, don't forget to subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. Here's a sneak peek of what we're going to be making today. We're going to be doing a Petri dish resin coaster. So let's jump in and get started. I'm going to be using the Pinata Alcohol Inks and Angel White Epoxy Paste. You can get the inks and the resin I'm using from the Epoxy Resin Store. I'm using the general use epoxy and you can also get that resin off Amazon I'll be sure to link it down below as well if you guys would rather purchase it off Amazon it's a really great resin and it's only like 40 or 45 dollars a gallon so it's really affordable too so what I did was just poured clear into my coaster mold as you could see and I'm just adding my colors I like to do three layers so I'll do um, one of my colors Blanco Blanco the same color another layer of Blanco Blanco and repeat that three times and I wanted to have a little bit of negative space in this piece I didn't want it to totally fill up with clear and here I'm just adding a little bit of clear that I had left over in my cup. I was trying to push some of that ink away so it would free up some space. And now I'm going in with the angel white. And I was actually trying the worm technique. I don't know if you guys have ever seen that, but it's basically where you go in with an opaque white pigment and just make squiggly lines in your piece. And that will give you some fun effects. And that was it. I just added a little bit of squiggles of the angel white, covered it up, let it dry for 24 hours, and here it is. I was so excited when I demolded this. It turned out awesome. This is probably the best Petri dish I have ever made. I had never used the angel white, um, kind of just pouring it into squig on squiggly lines, you know, onto the wet resin. So I definitely recommend doing that if you are going to be making Petri dishes. I'll link all the materials I used down below in the description box if you guys want to get any of the resin or pigments or alcohol inks and also the coaster mold too um, and i have some coupon codes so that'll save you guys at least 10 percent on your purchase but you can totally see all the fun details in this one it turned out really cool um, my angel white i added about a pea size amount to one ounce of resin and that was it for that um, i mixed up my resin and my pigments off camera just to save time but if you're to resin and you want to see a tutorial showing step by step how to mix your resin and your pigments I will link one of my tutorials down below in the description box be sure to check that out but let me know what you guys think of this one down in the comments I think it turned out really cool it's got lots of fun depth and fun details in there and I hope you give this a try thanks so much for watching if you liked it please leave me a like hit that thumbs up button don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys soon for another video. Bye!